Hi friends, welcome to Unfold Data Science. My name is Aman and I am a data scientist. With all my experience of 9 years in data science and machine learning, today I am going to talk to you about 4 major components of machine learning. So it's okay if you don't have any technical background, you just have to watch the video till the end so that you will have a high level understanding of how machine learning work and what are its main components. So let's get started. Yeah, I'm gonna fold school. So guys, my assumption here is some of you may not be from computer science background or some of you may not have an idea of how coding or algorithms or how computer system work. In that case, let me give you a simple example of how typically this system work. Let's say this is your Facebook login page. Okay. So in the Facebook login page, you will see a box asking your user ID and you will see other box asking your password, right? So what you enter here is your user ID and you enter here your password. Now, what you are essentially giving to the Facebook is nothing but data. Okay. And then there are some sets of instructions written in Facebook server by some person which takes this data combines with the instructions, right? And gives you result. This result is nothing but your Facebook homepage, right? Now this is how typically normally computer systems traditionally work okay my next question to you is do you see any intelligence in this process do you see some intelligence in this process by looking at this do you think computers are intelligent probably no it is just working on the instructions given by human and on the data provided by human so what is machine learning so there is another very big branch of computer science which talks about feeding intelligence into the systems so let me give you a brief overview of what is that so is there a way we can feed intelligence in computers of course there is a way okay and that field of study is known as artificial intelligence so artificial intelligence is a field of computer science so artificial intelligence is a field of computer science which deals with study of feeding intelligence into computers or machines and inside artificial intelligence we have a separate branch called machine learning so machine learning is a subset of what we call artificial intelligence the simple meaning is making machines intelligent with all this overview let me move into main topic for the day that is what are the four major components of machine learning so let me give you an example let's say you walk into a superstore let's say you walk into a superstore this is you and there are three more customers in the superstore at that time let's say customer 2 customer 3 and customer 4 okay in this data i am also capturing your age let's say you are 22 years old okay and customer 2 is 34 customer 3 is 43 and this person is 16 so i'm capturing your names and your age and let me capture another parameter i'm calling it dollar volume purchased right so let's say you buy product worth 20 dollars from that superstore someone buys 21 somebody buys 16 and somebody buys 8 so what you see here is component number one of machine learning that we call as data okay so i'm naming it as one but what is the use of this guy so we take this data and submit it to a machine and we tell to machine can you learn the pattern hidden in this data for example take the data and submit it to a computer system and tell learn pattern okay this system which is component number two of machine learning takes the data and learns the pattern hidden in the data and gives us 
an output that output is nothing but pattern this pattern is component number three of machine learning so till now what we have spoken about is there is a data and there is a machine which is helping us to learn the pattern hidden in the data okay so what is the fourth component the fourth component is using this pattern so what might be the use of this pattern the use of this pattern may be tomorrow another gentleman walks into the same store where you went and this gentleman's age is let's say 27 so we'll ask this guy hey since we have learned the pattern hidden in the data can you tell me what would be the probable dollar amount for this person and then we get an answer let's say 20 so this is the entire flow of how machine learning work at a high level there is a training data there is a machine which learns the pattern and then it gives a pattern as output and that output is used to help businesses in better estimation better prediction and n number of other things i'm sure you must be having lot of questions in your mind on this around this so just don't wait go in the comment section and post your questions i'll be happy to answer apart from that i hope you have liked the video please go ahead and press the like button and also share with your friends who are interested in knowing more about data science and machine learning please press the subscribe button thanks for watching take care